history, all four belts in the cruiserweight division will belong proudly around the waist of one man. We're gonna give him a lot of action this year and get him ready, uh, you know, in the next couple of years uh, to fight for a world title. Perfect, thank you very much. Thank Bob Aram. The question is, with Lomachenko fighting coming up, will it be in the big arena or the theater? The big arena, the big, big yeah. arena. We got a lot of seats, yeah, yeah, yeah. a lot of Ukrainians. To, uh, Beautiful, man. Now, speak on this fight coming up tomorrow night. You want to All these fights are good fight. I mean, the three young Puerto Rican fighters are terrific young men. Uh, the uh, uh, light heavyweight fight, this Votsik, I think, is the best light heavyweight around. Uh, the uh, 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 Ramirez uh, Amir Amam fight is a terrific contest. No one for sure knows who's going to win. Uh, and Mick Conlon is Mick Conlon. You know, uh, people love love the Mick, and they're going to be watching him perform his second straight St. Patrick's Day. Bob, a lot of controversy just broke down about a good week and a half ago with the situation with Canelo, with his tainted beef. What are your thoughts on this whole situation? Well, I think that it has to be investigated. The Nevada Commission should investigate it. It shouldn't be a bullshit investigation. There should be an investigation uh, uh, for the, all, all the factors. And if they conclude that it was from tainted meat, uh, give the kid a pass. And if it was for something else, bar him from fighting. Suspend him like you suspend all other fighters who test positive. I don't know what the facts are other than the fact that he uh, uh, tested positive, uh, but I think it requires a thorough investigation and not being swept under the rug and let the chips fall where they may. Well, this trainer is known for distributing beef in Mexico, right? You have a whole. Well, I don't know. I'm not a, uh, uh, a toxologist, I don't understand know exactly what the circumstances are and I wouldn't want to talk about it not knowing I think you needs an investigation I don't think we should jump to any kind of conclusions last question Anthony Joshua versus Parker how you see that one going down Ooh. Anthony Joshua versus Parker Parker's gonna beat him I'm telling everybody everybody's talking about a Joshua Wilder fight forget about that Parker's gonna beat Parker got a chin like iron. He's going to be there for the full 12 rounds, and he's going to beat Joshua. He's a better boxer than Joshua is. In history, all four belts in the cruiserweight division will belong proudly around the waist of one man.